I have my AA meeting tonight. Again? Well, I mean, you don't really graduate from alcoholism. So I'm supposed to watch Game of Thrones on my own, like a pervert. Rob is trying to be a better person. He's trying to look for something to sort of fill that hole. And uh, Sharon's kind of watching him do that, um, slightly worrying that if he becomes a better person, where that's going to leave her. <laughs> Have you thought about a bit of therapy? I'm going to AA, I'm working in a charity shop, plus my real job, and I'm doing the best I can. Those are for Frankie's lunch. Really? Did he pay for them? Or did I? I, I hope it's realistic, because that was the whole point, wasn't it, when we sort of set mm -hmm. out to do it at the very beginning, was to show an honest portrayal of that kind of relationship. Yeah, I think we just kind of wanted to paint in the boldest colors that we could because in real life you laugh hard at things you know and you get really scared of things so we really kind of wanted to dial it up and make it feel as realistic as possible we're laughing but there's definitely sort of oof, like we do yeah. that a lot when, yeah. when we when we read um scripts back at various points on the way if it's one of those brutal arguments we're like like some of the things that we would have um Douglas Hodge say to Ashley Johnson. Oh my God. Like, oh, oh, are we going to do that? How could we have him say that? <laughs> but uh, then feel really happy. We'd be like, oh, who wrote that? <laughs> oh, we did? Mm. I'm afraid your cholesterol level is quite high for a woman your age. Medically, you're saying if you took a normal sized mannequin and filled it with meatballs and margarine, that'd be me. Fine. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's a, it gets a bit of a steady stream response, yeah. doesn't it? There's so much TV now, you know, so people, you can't watch it all at once or at all at all. And so, uh, yeah, there are still people uh, just finding the first season, which, yeah, that's fine with us. Yeah, we love that.